French rugby legend Dominici dies in Park Tragedy. He played 67 times for France and in recent years had become a familiar figure on TV and radio. Ex-France rugby international Christophe Dominici has been found dead in tragic circumstances in a park. Dominici, 48, was best known for helping France knock out the New Zealand All Blacks in the 1999 Rugby World Cup. A witness saw him climb the roof of a disused building at St. Cloud Park near Paris on Tuesday before falling, officials say. Prosecutors have opened an inquiry into the cause of his death. Dominici played 67 times for his country and won the French Championship five times with Stade Francais before retiring in 2008. In recent years he had worked as a rugby pundit for French radio and TV. His 1999 World Cup semi-final performance spurred France to a sensational comeback, as he darted down the left of the pitch and seized the ball ahead of two New Zealand defenders to score a try. The All Blacks were leading the game at the time and had the brilliant Jonah Lomu in their lineup. Known as Domi, he was 1.72 metres in height, 5 feet 6 inches, and earned a reputation for weaving runs that could change the course of a match. He played in four Six Nations winning teams and won two Grand Slams. His death has stunned the world of rugby. France's Rugby Federation said the national sport was, in mourning after the tragic death of our wing Christophe Dominici. We're particularly thinking of his family and loved ones. A similar message came from the other big rugby nations. The Welsh Rugby Union said, adieu Christophe Dominici. What a player. Former Stade Francais president Max Guazzini who was close to Dominici, told French radio he was deeply upset by the news. I always told the others he was my favourite player. Ex-teammate Vincent Clare said it was terrible news. I came up against him in the past and it was tough. You felt he had this passion to win. Former Ireland captain Brian O'Driscoll described, a French player full of flair with huge success throughout his career. May he rip. Earlier this year Dominici was heavily involved in a bid by a consortium from the United Arab Emirates to take over the financially troubled Bezier's rugby club in the south of France. The bid was halted by the sport's financial regulator and Dominici was said by friends to have taken the failure very badly. In a 2009 Le Monde interview, he said rugby, let me understand many things, respect for life, people and oneself, along with the values of humility and combat. I was aggressive and put that to collective use. Now I have far more wisdom and maturity. News taken from BBC, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.